got a badge or something, Mr. Jaden? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Hey, Jaden, you come and see me if you find anything, okay? We're on the same team now. The killer came this way with the body and probably grazed it on his way through the fence. Gotta keep my act together. At least for now. The zone is sectioned off, sir. Please step back. Agent Norman Jaden, FBI. You got a badge or something, Mr. Jaden? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Check. You can pass. I'm looking for Lieutenant Blake. Is he around? I saw him arrive earlier. He's here somewhere. Thanks. Goddamn rain. Hasn't stopped pouring since I arrived. I'm really gonna love it here. Reporters? Already? Huh. They seem well informed. Video memo recording, Agent 47023, Nam and Jaden, Tuesday, October 4th, 2011. Time is 8.14 a.m. Related to the investigation. I'm Agent Norman Jaden from the FBI. I went by your office this morning, they told me to be here. Now if you're looking for rain, dead bodies, and highways, you come to the right place. Mike, will you tell that asshole with the bulldozer to stop for five minutes? I can't hear myself think here. Right away, Lieutenant. Well, are you coming, Jaden? So, what happened? Some guy taking his dog for a piss found a body about 6 o'clock this morning. We don't know much more right now. Based on what we've seen, looks like the work of the origami killer. Has the body been identified? No, not yet. We should know more later today. Any news on the coroner? He's on his way, Lieutenant. We've been waiting for an hour, for fuck's sake. 
There are a lot of people on the crime scene. Aren't you afraid your men might destroy some clues? You don't find proof sitting behind a desk. We're not in the habit of trampling things into the ground, even if we're not in the FBI. No, no, of course not. That's, that's not what I meant. Tony, I don't want to see a single shit stirring journalist within a mile of here. You got it? Yes, Lieutenant. Any witnesses? None yet. Given the neighborhood, I'd be surprised if anybody saw anything. Listen, I I'm a little busy here. Why don't we discuss all this a little later, back at the office? Oh, no problem. I understand. Do you mind if I have a look around? Be my guest. Hey, Jaden. You come and see me if you find anything, okay? We're on the same team now. Harry County, sample of no interest. Comes from one of the policemen present on the wasteland. Is that a coffee you're drinking there? There's some in the thermos behind you. Help yourself. When did they find the body? Excuse me, but... Who are you exactly? Nam and Jaden, FBI. If you want to ask questions, you should speak to Lieutenant Blake, sir. Pretty chilly, huh? Lousy weather, huh? Does it always rain like this? It rains every fall. Doesn't it do that where you come from? Oh, yeah. Yeah, of course. Some orchid pollen. The concentration of pollen in the air is quickly decreasing because of the rain, but it gets higher in the direction of the body. Harry Common, the victim is lying on his back. No visible signs of violence. An orchid was placed on the victim's chest. A small origami figure in the right hand. Fingers were probably closed after the time of death. The victim is Jeremy Bowles. Declared missing five days ago. See reference file. His face is covered with mud, like the other victims. Superficial wound on the right thigh. Blood analysis suggests it could be post-mortem. Probably a scratch that occurred when the body was being moved. The blood report indicates an advanced and long-lasting state of exhaustion.
Harry comment, sample of no interest, comes to one of the policemen present on the wasteland. Dead cat. The FBI doesn't keep files on dead cats. Not yet. Column particles disappear in the tall grass. It's probably the end of the trail. Ari coming. Traces of blood on the railroad track. Analysis confirms it comes from the victim. Footprints continue just after the pollen trail. There's a good chance that they're the killers. Harry coming. There are traces of blood on the fence behind the railroad line. It comes from the victim. The killer came this way with the body and probably grazed it on his way through the fence. There's a good chance that they're the killers. There's a railroad track near where the body was left. Same as all the other victims. Harry coming. Tire tracks on the side of the road behind the railroad line. It may be the killer's car. You have seen all there is to see. I think I've seen enough. Better get back to the station before I catch pneumonia. Way too many people here.
They're trampling all over the crime scene. Back to the office. You stay in. No, I've seen enough. I'm leaving too. 